Hey guys, welcome to another Crown Data Systems training video. In this video, we're going to go over our Doc Manager app. Um, we're going to show you how this makes your business more efficient. Our Doc Manager app allows your dock workers to electronically update their shipment statuses in real time as they're unloading and loading freight. Let's get started. You can get our app by going to the Google Play Store, typing in Crown Data Systems, and then you'll see Crown Dock Manager. Go ahead and download that and you should be able to have it on your tablet. Open up the app and it'll bring you to the login screen. Now the first time that you download this app, you will be asked for an API key. The API key is generated on our end and it just tells the app which one of our companies to connect to. You only have to type this in one time, which is the first time you download it. After that, you will be good to go. Now you can log in with your username and password that you use for your crown. When you log in, it's going to take you to the home screen where you'll see an on hand out for delivery and edit previous session. Once you have your freight on hand, we're going to go into on hand mode. Go ahead and select your terminal. Here you have a few options to search by routing and carrier, driver, customer search, or if you just have the label, you can scan to search. If I choose that, you can now go ahead and scan your label. Your shipment would say scan match. You'll have your shipment information here. And if I hit OK, it's going to show me on the right side my on hand count. The positive number is the number we scanned and the negative number is how many is remaining. So right here we have two more left. Scan it two more times. Once you have all your pieces, you'll see that the box has turned green and there will be an equal sign instead of the number. Go ahead and click done. And you will head back to the home screen. Now in Crown, if I go ahead and refresh my dispatch grid, I can see that the status of the shipment after I've scanned it has been changed to on hand. If I open it up, I can see that the on-hand time matches the time that I've scanned the shipment. You can also add pieces manually or edit your DIMMs when you mark your freight on hand. Enter on-hand mode. Choose your terminal again. Here you'll see your scan match. Go ahead and open the shipment to edit it. Now if you don't want to scan all three pieces, what you can do is just manually enter in the number of pieces. If you go here to DIMMs, I'll ask you if you would like to add the DIMMs. Go ahead and click edit and enter in your DIMMs. Hit done and save and exit. Go ahead and hit done. Now back in your crown, go ahead and refresh your grid. And you will see that the shipment was marked on hand. Open up the shipment and you would see your edited DIMMs and you can head back to your Doc app. 
Now, the Dock app also allows you to manage your OSND shipments. Let's go ahead and enter on hand mode. Let's go ahead and try searching by routing. Here it's going to have a list of all your routing that you have set up in your shipment. And it's going to pull up all the shipments you have assigned for, in this case, Delta. Go ahead and scan. And it will automatically scan and match the shipment that you scanned. Now, you see that we have three more pieces left. If I go ahead and just scan two, and I go ahead and click done, I will have a little prompt that says shipments on hold. It'll warn me that the shipments are OSND. And it gives you the option to save the on hand session with OSND or not. If I go ahead and hit yes, save, and exit. Once I go back to my crown, I will see that the shipment that was short was marked on hold. Now this is a setting that you can implement or get rid of if you'd like. Let's go ahead and open the shipment that's on hold. If I click the OSND button, it will tell me that it was shorted and how many pieces out of four were scanned. If you have a damaged shipment, the app allows you to take a photo and send it directly to Crown. Let's open up the app. Enter on hand mode. Go ahead and click OK. Now scan your pieces. I'm going to open up the shipment and I'm going to go ahead and hit the OSMD button on the upper right hand corner. I can choose the reason, blue, and add some notes. I can also Add a photo. Hit the check mark. Go ahead and hit the right hand corner check mark and hit save and exit. You're going to see OSND on the shipment and you want to go ahead and click done. Again, I will give you the warning. If you save and exit, head back into your crown, and you'll see that the shipment is also marked on hold. Open it up. You will see your notes that you entered and the reason. And if you click the attachment, preview it, and it is the photo that you took. Now we're going to look at out for delivery mode. So I go ahead and assign a driver to one of my shipments. Save it. Now OFD is going to look at any shipment in your system from today to three days in the future that is on hand and also has a driver assigned to it. From there, you can go ahead into the app and mark it OFD. So if I open up the app, 
here I can select OFD mode. Now for the shipments that I want to mark OFD, I have to have my driver assigned to it. If I choose OFD and the terminal, it is going to pull up all the drivers I have assigned. Go ahead and choose your driver. And here you see all your shipments on hand and assigned to your driver. Go ahead and scan your labels. Now you'll see that your pieces that you expected are now there. You can also manually edit your shipment, so go ahead and tap it. Here you can enter in OSD information if you'd like. If you want to take a photo, you can through the photo option. You can enter any notes. And you can go ahead and hit save. Go ahead and hit save and refresh. And if we go back to Crown, we'll see that the shipment is now marked OFD. So these are the basics from start to finish on how to use our Doc app. If you guys have any questions at all, leave a comment, give us a call, or shoot us an email. Thanks so much for watching, and stay tuned for more videos.